Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm B. Today's video, I'm living in a car. But before I will give you a tour in that car, I will give you a few disclaimer. Let's start with this. It's a financial decision. An opportunity come up from the Philippines that someone selling a house. So I'm thinking why I shouldn't grab this opportunity because this been my dream to have a house. It's hard to like renting a house in the Philippines. So I grabbed the opportunity, but I have to save more money because I'm also paying rent on my accommodation. So I decided to buy this car and live with it to save some money. As a result guys, I was able to pay off my house for one year. But before we get across that car that I'm gonna show you, let's have a look around where I'm living at this moment. Let's go! Yeah, this is where I'm living. So after I decided to move out from that car because guys it's so crazy when there's a thunderstorm. I feel like everything is shaking and then oh my god it's just like it's a nightmare. It's always a nightmare because uh you're in the car. Can you imagine? Like so and yes <laughs> but it's fun it's a new experience it's it's funny isn't it i come to australia to live in a car so people is thinking that i'm living in luxury but they didn't even know that i am living in a car but now they know let's go This one is the taxi that I'm cleaning every day. Sometimes in life, you have to make sacrifices to achieve your goal. So for me, this time, it's my comfort. And the second thing I should be telling you, it's actually a ban. For some people that doesn't know, about it it's a motor home on it's a car on wheels that you can go anywhere so let's go i will show you guys so, this is it this is the bad boy that i live for 10 months and this is the front seat and uh, this one but this one, this car is drivable. So it's a high ace van. It's small, but as you can see, I'm small, so it's fine. I can fit here. So this one, we have a passenger seat, uh, but you know, it's hard to drive this because this is manual. So I get used to drive a automatic one. So. She said, you get to learn to drive a stick, you know. So, let's go inside. This one, this car is parked over here because I'm not living in this one at this moment. But if you have to live in it, you have to go to the proper site. So, you got to get a electricity and water connection. Yeah, so let's go inside. There's a door here if you want to put some stuff underneath, but this one jumped up so I cannot open it anymore. Just decided to be a dick because you know it's been a while that I'm not using it, so it's stuck up. So let's go inside. Welcome to my home. 14 months. So, as you can see, I have a bed over here. Uh, sorry for the mess because I I still have 
some stops over here that I didn't move in with me because I have a lot of stops so I think I have to throw this away some of my stuff have to be thrown away because it's not fit to my closet anymore so and oh before I forget please do subscribe on to my channel guys if you have comments and suggestion just comments on the comment section below and please do check my bio there's always something good in it and if you want to talk with me you can book a consultation whatever you want to know about philippines or you want me to talk about something about filipina or about your filipina if you have one don't hesitate to contact me you can follow me in instagram facebook and email me if you want and let's proceed i have a small cabinet over here as you can see there's a lot of stuff in here yeah and i have a small sink in here here you can but the good thing about this sink is you can close it so you can put some stuff over here and you can open this one to put some stuff underneath this is a cupboard and you can close it and if you want to use the sink you can open it put this the post it up and you can wash 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 and i have a cabinet over here yeah, sorry for the mess again and i have a bar fridge look at that i've been uh, not living here for almost four to five months maybe if i'm not mistaken and yeah so there's an underneath on the bed there you can put all your stuff so it's not messy around so this van is just like when you come home sleep where i'm living before i put a donut around it so i can walk around but the thing guys there is every time there's a rain i cannot sleep because i'm thinking that all the setup will be collapsing because uh the, here in australia oh my god there's always a hurricane and it's scary so in the philippines although i live in the philippines and i live in the province we have typhoons all the time but australia is really really scary because one time there's a hurricane here and i saw huge trees fall down so in the philippines that would be a strong a strong typhoon to do that but here it's just a uh, it's not really a uh, a strong hurricane it's just like a uh, just willy willy i hope you enjoy watching my video if you want to get notified for my next video please hit the notification bell guys bye bye